So the idea behind the Shadow One was purely we felt that there was a need for this product in the marketplace. Uh, um, one of our main competitors have been building similar products. In fact, a couple of the competitors or, or manufacturers have been building similar products, but, but we just felt that it, the product needed, there was room for improvement, we could up the game. We could bring out a, uh, an awning, a 270 shadow awning that would just outclass the competitors' products. So we looked for the materials that we felt was the best materials available. We built it stronger, lighter than, than any of the other products on the market. And, and the fabric that we're using in, in the shadow horn is, is imported from Europe. It's what they call an aluminiumized acrylic, which is reflective, um, but at the same time it keeps out all the weathers, the waters, the, the UV rays, and it, and it runs cooler. If you ever set an awning up, you're normally fighting and, and battling with poles and trying to get it to balance and you need people to help. This unit, you literally zip it out of the bag, you can run it around to 270 degrees, clip it up and your awning is there, it's up. You, you flick a center post to give you a little bit more tension on the material, on the cloth and a bit of drain off if there's a bit of rain and that's it, job done, you, you've got the shade. We offer one center post that is for those really, really adverse conditions where the wind is pumping and, and more down in the Cape than anywhere else. And that's also, it just gives it that little bit of added strength. But the awning doesn't need poles. It, it is that strong that it can stand without poles. And, and in strong winds, there's ropes that are inserted or, or strapping that's inserted into each post. The pegs come in the back, so they're always there. And you can put the peg in the ground, pull the post down, and. I always make a silly little joke to the customers to say, look, in a strong wind, we suggest that you tie the awning down because we've had one or two of the vehicles blow over. So in a way, you literally release the, the, the tie back, you, you run the awning back in, and then you roll up the skirt and zip it up. It, it fits into its bag easily, it's easily easy to pack away, and um, it's just a, a pleasure to have.